Hello Leo and welcome to your coffee cup reading for the week ahead of August 5th through the 11th. Wow. Wow, you have a powerful new beginning. Okay, there are some spiritual doubts here or feeling like, why is this happening to me? You know, you're questioning some your belief systems and that. Sometimes it is a tear. But, you know, whatever that is, know that the universe has your back, okay? It's like there will be blessings in disguise or there's going to be some kind of healing, okay? That's one thing I'm seeing. Remember, it is a general reading. But I do see endings, new beginnings, and a powerful new um, beginning. Expressing yourself, uh, victory um, through that, and pushing ahead on your goals is coming through here too. Use your third eye chakra because I see that too. So that means also your intuition is very sharp. There's an underlining energy of uh, needing to create balance. Give and take is very important. For some of you, this is trying to get a raise. This is selling something, making money too. So I do see that energy as well. I do see there's been some stress, okay? Taking care of your health and well-being is very important as well. Okay, so do take care of that. I do also see for some of you, this love is, well, love is strongly accented for everyone. But I do see this could be new love for some, renewal for love for others. Okay, it's a new emotional beginning. I do see you are coming into focus. There is something that you are, you're going to be noticed. Okay, even though you're keeping more to yourself, um, there's a sense of your charm, whatever. There's something that's attracting the energy to others. I do see you may have to make some kind of choice and decision. You may have to make some quick decisions, but you need to think before you do make decisions. Don't be too hasty. That's one thing I'm seeing. You need to have more faith in yourself too. Um, trust that the universe um, uh, is, you know, is helpful. Trust in yourself. I'm seeing that. So it could be trust issues with yourself or with others as well. Very strong energy and also intuition. So really go with that. You have... You're drawing upon strength when it comes to completing some kind of maybe agreement. Maybe this is a sale, signing some kind of document. This could be dealing with court legalities too. So I see that energy. Um, I do see you need to do something a little bit different. Patience is needed because justice will be in your favor somehow, whatever that would mean to you. But it's going to, um, it just, you need to have some patience, okay? So I do see that, okay? And I do see you feeling like things are not going to work out for you financially maybe and also some other areas in your life. There's a sense of lack of, okay? But no, it will, okay? I do see a refreshing energy, a rebirthing, an emotional refreshment. There's been some evaluations and still continuing with that. Now, do watch your temper. Someone could maybe aggravate you and piss you off but that's going to bring you success and victory it's like maybe something had to be said now there can be a sudden change too this could be you suddenly want to move you make um, a vacation plan and you're on the road like that there is some kind of change okay so change is coming through so dealing with some changes for sure i do see victory success on its way so i see that your social circle of that may be expanding too it's like communicating with different types of energies i'm seeing Hard work and perseverance is going to pay off because they're focused also on that. So a lot of that is coming through. Now, I do see that there is um, romantic energy. Love is coming through. There could be offers coming in. Um, this energy is very rare that I see connected to love. So this could be one of the most romantic weeks or a day or something in the year for some of you, Okay. Um, if if you already are in a relationship or that, uh, the energy can definitely just fuel your ability to kind of hit big with, um, you know, give and take, shared goals, uh, reveling in your love again, renewal of love. Now, if you're single, there is something about coming out where people are, okay? Putting yourself self out there is going to lead to either meeting someone and that person is going to be kind of like a soulmate. It feels like a soulmate, if anything, okay? There's going to be maybe sudden um, love at first sight or that connection too. So that is for some of you, all right? Um, I do see opportunities coming through too. Um, and your imagination is very strong too. There's ambitious ideas coming through. And you can also make them very concrete, okay? Put some um, action into some of the plans there. Um this is a good time to also talk to people that can, um, you know, you can climb the ladder with so that or they can help you climb the ladder. So don't hesitate to call meetings with either higher ups or give 
give it your all when it comes to expression, presentations, interviews, things like that. Because you're definitely, uh, you got luck on your side. You'll definitely soar here, okay? So it looks good. Now, the plate kind of speaks a little bit different. See, it's very, very watery. This could mean emotions, um, your emotions, health and well-being. Uh, uh, it's changeable. So there's something changeable there. But at the same time, this could be, a watch. you know, sometimes uh, watch the plumbing at home. Um, maybe you'll just be by water, okay? I still see very good energy here where I am seeing it's like the world is your oyster, okay? There is a successful conclusion. It's like it's open opportunities there, able to um, successfully close some, um, just say deals, um, agreements or something. Very nice. This can also be long distance travel or thoughts of travel. Um, I do see success, uh, win situation. Very nice. Um, it's like your recognition is coming. And also looking back how to where you got, it's like you've got some things to wrap up and you're just about to move forward. Okay. So you're really coming to your own, so to speak for some of you. Okay. Well, Looks pretty good. Um, but watch your health and well-being too, okay? Now, what I want to say is uh, next week I will not be booking any readings. I will be closing down the website just for a few days uh, because I will be out of town. I will be on vacation. Um, and I do have timely readings. And to avoid any confusion because no matter how much I do my updates page or make announcements, some people have order and then they like, well, where's my weekly reading? Well... I'm on vacation, <laughs> so to avoid that, I will do that, and then I will open it up sometimes during my vacation anyway, then you can place orders that are not timely, like um, coffee cup readings and so, so, so forth, even birthday Leo readings too, um, some that I'm not going to be here and I couldn't do it on time, I've already done, um, and then I, I will book them and schedule them when I get back, as long as they're not timely readings, so, so it's not a problem. Um... As far as YouTube goes, I will be posting um, next Friday weekly readings too, so I'll get them done somehow on the roads. So you're not going to miss out on that at all. And always check my updates page. It does, on my website, it does usually keep you updated with what's going on, okay? Now, for all Leos who have a birthday this week, August 5th through the 11th, I want to wish you a very happy birthday, um, a beautiful solar year ahead, many blessings to you. And for everyone else, a wonderful week too. And I will catch you all back next week for your next reading. Until then, um, I think I did cover it all. Yeah, this reading was for the week of August 5th to 11th. I think I did say that. And yes, happy birthday to the ones. And yes, I did announce that. I'm just <laughs> checklist off my head here. Yeah, so that'll be it. Catch you back next week. Bye for now.